boy so hot, maybe I should cool off. Open the window, yeah, they call it Microsoft. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leon. I'm Tim Cooler, the South African Geek. Welcome to my channel. I'm about to watch a Men and Wasp Avengers for Connection feature. Okay. Oh, it's quite long, actually. Uh huh. Let me get the volume up a little bit. Okay, I'm just going to dive right in. Wasp is a legacy character. She's right there on the cover of Avengers number one. Finally, every single character from that first issue of Avengers is here on the big screen. We saw the original Wasp, Janet Van Dyne, in a brief flashback in the first movie. And at the end of the movie, we finally saw a new suit. And Hank Pym realizing, of course, this suit belongs to his daughter, Hope. It's about damn time. And now an Ant-Man Wasp is here in all Hello, eyes. Watch this. She gets to wear the suit that she's been coveting her whole life. He so desperately wanted to follow in the footsteps of her parents, who had been incredible superheroes in their day. And so she's finally doing that. Oh, is getting another flash there? Incredible drive as a fighter, as a scientist, to be this hero. She's the toughest one in the movie. She lives to be a wasp. She lives to be the superhero mantle. Follow my lead. This film is primarily a fun, clever, emotional story of family. Because of the quantum realm is where Hope's mother, Janet Van Dyne, the original wasp, had been lost, presumably forever. I was in the quantum realm, and I think I saw Janet. Now the mission becomes what? can they go down there and bring it back her mom? This technology. I didn't know that. I knew the mother was coming back, but I didn't know she went to the quantum realm again. Can't play the trailer again. No, that was amazing. But there was like just they were kind of like just telling you that she she and Ant Man have a bigger part in Avengers for it. That's the connection. That's such a tease, though. Goddamn! Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Like that was such a tease.